Hi, in this video we are going to look into pumpkin spice web challenge from hack the boo. So first we are going to extract the files 7zx. Then we will open it into our Visual Studio code. It's Python 3.alpine. Okay. Copy flag. Okay. and it's calling the entry point as such we'll go here move flag txt dot this and let's see what this command actually does so it's renaming the flag dot txt as you can see is generating a random number and alphabetical combination the requirements are same like the previous challenge flask selenium so it's starting the bot and host addresses it's calling this address and it's checking like okay so this endpoint will only be accessed internally like it's checking the remote address and it's getting the remote address from this we cannot bypass it so definitely the challenge uh, itself is saying that it's an xss so this address is exposed so we need to put an address and it's appending that address then it's starting the bot and it's calling this service and it's rendering this all addresses in address.html so in the whole flow this api is never uh, is never been called so it's taking if the request from inside and it's getting a command variable and it's executing so our target is to uh, hit this endpoint through xss so for that i will need a public ip so i don't have public ip right now so i will use ngrock so ngrock http and port 80 and uh, this url i will use it's redirecting to my local host so at the same time i will open a listener on local host 80 so anything comes in this url it will redirect to the local host 80 and we can see that request in here we will redirect our traffic to popsuit okay and we are going to rip and close this script src as the address is now is not being sanitized anywhere so we, we will directly inject that so we'll copy our copy section and it control c and we are going to first try like if we are getting a request back or not address registered if we see here we have got a request we are getting a connection a request back from the server so what we are going to do this is web pumpkin and we will create our 
payload here. So new XML HTTP request. And first the method name we are going to use get because if you see it's a get method and this is the path the method get and the path is this thing and we have seen like it's getting the argument so name with the command so we will give it command equal to ls this so we want to see what's inside the uh, root directory because we, we cannot uh, directly get the flag.txt because it has been uh, renamed we'll send it and let response is equal to response text and here we will give our ip uh, our url ngrock Uh, is our payload here and we'll give rest is equal to it seems correct and it's in the correct directory also let's see yes yes expjs is here we'll serve it again and now we will change our payload to this thing to exp yes and we will paste it here submit let's see we got 200 okay and we got the files also so we see like there is an entry point sh and there is a directory etc and this is our flag name then there is home leave media so we want this flag name now ours will edit a bit cat we will paste it and go here we will save it again we will send it again and here is the flag so this is the box it's a nice excess that's the challenge all the best